So prior to opening, we need to make sure that the machine is on and up to temperature, and this takes around 20 minutes. To make sure, rinse a little bit of hot water around the handles. This makes sure that everything that touches the coffee is piping hot. We've now got a series of steps to follow to make the espresso. Select the correct group handle. Today, I'm going to be preparing double espressos throughout. Step two, remove the handle and flush the group for a few seconds. This is the effect of clearing the group of old coffee and also getting the group to the correct temperature. Next step is to clean and dry the basket. This is a really important step using a dry, clean cloth. It makes sure that there's no weak points for the water to find in the coffee. Step four, grind the coffee, pressing the correct button for the dose of coffee, making sure to catch all the grounds for a consistent dose. Next step, tamp level and with a firm handshake's worth of pressure always resting on a level surface. The coffee should always form a good seal. Connect the group handle and brew straight away, even before you place your cups. Watch for signs of good extraction. Ideally, the flow of espresso will look like runny honey. We're looking to collect around 25 milliliters in a specific extraction time. For most coffees, this will be between 25 and 30 seconds from the moment the button is pressed until the extraction stops but consult your own brand standard recipes for exact details for your coffee. 